Good morning, good morning, or good afternoon, depending upon what time you are listening. Today is Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. This time space sequence we call September the 24th, 2019. This is Sean Speaks, and I'll be reading for you the blog post from the website at freerthinkingmind.com entitled Consciousness, What Does That Mean? Consciousness, What Does That Mean? Our affirmation for today, I am conscious of my internal power. I am conscious of my internal power. I talk a lot about awareness and consciousness, but those words mean different things to different people. And some people even fear these words because they believe they challenge the status quo of belief as if what was said has to always be said or what was true has to always be true, or what was believed has to always be believed. Are you not allowed to listen and watch when everyone else is shouting, crying, or responding in some way on cue, and you not be prompted by the cue? What if the conditioned cues no longer control you. Try it. Anyone or anything that wants you to fear your own consciousness or self-awareness, in my opinion, wants to control you and keep you in a mental and or emotional bondage or loop that your own consciousness could free you from if only you would be willing to become aware of yourself. But most of us are so comfortable being controlled that we don't want to be in control of our own thinking, of our own believing, and of our own being. And this is true for some people because for the longest time, it was absolutely true for me. And if I am honest, still true in some ways. For clarity purposes, I would like to share what I mean about awareness or consciousness. I believe once you become aware of your own awareness, you are empowered with a new kind of freedom, one that allows you to be different, but integrates you simultaneously. A freedom that has you as the source authority over your life and authority over your own beingness that many of us have been trained to avoid, to detest, and to deny. This consciousness or this awareness sort of triggers sort of an internal creativity from within. The creativity necessary to live your life the way you want is in your consciousness. The best explanation I have read that clearly explains consciousness is actually found in a book entitled Flow, written by a man named Miha Cheek Sinmiha. It's a very difficult name to pronounce, but it's Miha Cheek Sinmiha. His explanation of the function of consciousness or awareness, the word I most like to use, helps you to understand not only what is meant by the word and its variations, but to accept the internal beatific power each of us have within ourselves, if only we were bold enough to look within and then to exercise this power in our daily lives. Once you can appreciate your own consciousness and not be afraid of it, no matter the unfounded fears given to you, you will wonder why you ever denied yourself the power to enlighten yourself. See, when you tap into your own awareness or your own consciousness, you realize that you have the power to enlighten yourself from within out. But many of you, even after reading this, will look in the mirror and after seeing yourself Reject your internal power from within to genuflect to another's creation for help. Miha Cheeks and Miha says in flow, and I quote, 
The function of consciousness is to represent information about what is happening outside and inside the organism in such a way that it can be evaluated and acted upon by the body. In this sense, it functions as a clearinghouse for sensations, perceptions, feelings, and ideas, establishing priorities among all the diverse information. Without consciousness, we would still know what is going on, but we would have to react in a reflexive, instinctive way. With consciousness, we can deliberately weigh what the senses tell us respond accordingly. And we can also invent information that did not exist before. It is because we have consciousness that we daydream, make up lies, and write beautiful poems and scientific theories, end quote. I agree with me, Ha Cheeks and Miha's sort of function of, of, of consciousness. Because the way I look at it is that consciousness is the, an awareness of your creativity. Consciousness is a oneness of your power to create. And anything or anyone or any organization or any group or any person that wants to take away or hijack your ability to be the creative power of your own existence is taking away the power of you. Our affirmation, I am conscious of my internal power. I am conscious of my internal power. Thank you so much for listening to the uh, blog post, uh, audio, audio blogcast podcast presented to you by freeyourthinkingmind.com. Um, please def- definitely go over to the uh, website and subscribe and share. Please go to our YouTube channel at, at, at uh, FYTM Network and subscribe and share. And also subscribe and share to our podcast, broadcast at freeyourthinkingmind.podbean.com. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful Tuesday. Ashe, whatever you say, may it come to you. Happy Tuesday.